What's up, yo? Big Bird Joe. Just checking in with everybody, see how everybody's holidays went. Second day of January, everybody's New Year's going. Made any New Year's resolutions. You know, a couple of weeks ago, I had an interview with a pastor here in Conway, E.C. Maltby of True Holiness Saint Center. At the end of the interview, I asked him if he was content with his life, and immediately he said no. And it kind of struck me at first to... Uh, Shocked a little bit because figured he would be content. But he immediately followed up with, he felt like he had more work he had to do in his life. And, you know, he was referencing his, his pastoring and in his personal life too. But, you know, it kind of got me to thinking, you know, what's the difference in being happy and being content? You know, we should be happy every day with what we have, right? But we should never be content. Because, you know, every chance we get, we need to prove ourselves, right? You know, New Year's resolutions are fine, but, you know, every day is a new chance to start over, right? Every hour, every second, every minute. You know, simple things, you know. You know, and, and being better doesn't mean that what you're doing is wrong. It just means that maybe something you're doing in your life that needs to change needs to change. You know, whether it's going a day without drinking a soda or... You know, maybe studying an extra 30 minutes for that test that you don't normally put in that extra work, right? You know, maybe you decide I'm, today I'm going to only smoke five cigarettes instead of seven or eight like I normally do, right? You know, fighting and scratching and clawing and, and trying to get better is, is a good thing, right? Having that fight inside you is a good thing, right? As long as you're fighting for the things that are right, things that are good, right? So don't be content with anything in your life. Make changes for the better, right? Fight for others. Fight for yourself. Forgive yourself. Forgive others. You know, the New Year's resolution that all of us should have is the most important part is we need to understand each other. We need to understand that sometimes the demons that are inside of us are of our, our own making. But we also need to understand that there are demons inside people even ourselves, other people, are put there by others. And we need to be understanding of that, right? And those are the people that we need to love the most. But love yourself, love others, be understanding. Try to make positive changes every day. Try to make positive changes every minute. But that also means that if you don't you do what you think, you know, your goals are set out to do, don't don't be hard on yourself. You know, if you, you want to smoke five cigarettes today instead of seven, but you ended up smoking ten, don't beat yourself up. Just do better tomorrow. Do better an hour from now, a minute from now, a second from now, right? Everybody, hope everybody has a good first of the year, 2022. I'm out here right now about to hike Willie Hollow State Park. I never thought in a million years I would even come close to doing some of the things I've accomplished. Baby steps, right? Just every day, every minute, every second, just doing things a little bit better than you did before, right? Don't be content, but don't be angry. Don't be angry at yourself. Don't be angry at others if they fall short of your expectations, right? Be good. Be good to yourself. Be good to others.